Yes, there are numerous incentives available for Tobago's businesses, as stated by the Minister of Trade and Industry, Paula Gupiskun. She made these statements at a press conference following a multi-stakeholder meeting with the business community in Tobago, which also involved Chief Secretary Farley Augustin. The details in this report from Candace Jackson. The multi-stakeholder meeting facilitated by the Tobago Division of the Trinidad and Tobago Chamber of Industry and Commerce is being hailed as a success, according to Chairman Curtis Williams. Um, it was a very, very um, great informal, informal session and um, a lot was discussed and we know this is just the beginning and, um, and we're definitely going to expand the, the relationship going forward with the Ministry of Trade and the THA. A wide cross-section of the business community was present at the meeting, where they learned about a suite of incentives available from the Ministry of Trade and Industry. One of those incentives is the formation of a facility to allow businesses to access foreign exchange, according to Minister of Trade and Industry, Polo Gupiskun. And that is going to provide SME, SMEs, um, not only those involved with um, in manufacturing, but across a lot of other sectors, so that I believe that even though you're in retail, the system will allow you to have access to, um, to, to foreign exchange. So Representatives from Exim Bank, Export TT and several other government services were present to provide greater details on how the incentives could be accessed by the business community. We want more businesses to grow, to take advantage of the facilities that are available for capacity building, for access to export, for training and development. Meanwhile, Chief Secretary Farley Augustin noted that Tobago is currently experiencing an expansion of the business sector, particularly among young people. He said some are in receipt of assistance from both the central government and the THA. However, Augustin pointed out that more can benefit. But the business sector must take command of those opportunities. They have to do the applications, they have to ensure that they are formally registered and all of those things. Um, and ensure that their business um, meets the requirement. The Tobago Division of the Trans Tobago Chamber of Industry and Commerce is preparing to launch a Tobago Business Advisory Services Initiative aimed at assisting businesses in accessing these services on Thursday. Candace Jackson, Tobago Updates Television News.